Hey guys, so it's the next morning, um, I'm just turned 86, and from, I think last time, you guys would have saw I got a neck reels task, so yeah, we're about, I'm about to do it now, but I've just been at the GE, and I've just been doing, you know, the daily staff runs, I'm about to do, um, uh, Tears of Gothics for my room crafting, but yeah, I've got a bursting task, and this is originally the boots I've been wearing, Mystic boots, because I, you know, I've had haven't had much money in the past, and I've only just hit 100 mil for the very first time in my total bank account. Um, some, so yeah, I was like, fuck it, why not go and try to get and get internal boots? Because um, I looked into it, and yeah, they're they're fucking a lot better than Mystic boots, and it'd just be a sick upgrade. Like, look, they've got, like, just general defense, um, and they've got the magic defense as well, and the magic o offense of eight. I was, it was either this or I was going to get the master wand, but um, the master wand's a bit more expensive, and it only offers, off like, 20 offensive magic and defense. But, you know, if you're versing in, like, other types of creatures, the um, eternal boots are probably better for you. Well, that's what I gathered anyway, so I'm probably going to just, you know, yeah, spend my money on this and just upgrade it. So, fuck yeah. This is my first time wearing these boots. These look sick. Oof. Yeah, man. Fucking hell. Oh, one upgrade after the other. That's how, that's what I like to see. Good shit. I right, will test these on the next. Ooh. Damn, 100 left. This task is going very quick. And a quick scroll. So... We shall do this after the task. Ooh. Ooh, about to kill the first bigger and badder neck. Let's see what we get. Hopefully it's something alright. I still want the enchanted gem or the imbued heart from it. That'd be sick. Oh, nah. What do we get? Uh, a totem piece. Not too bad. Yeah, but yeah. Okay, ended up finishing the neck reels task. Gonna get another one now. Um, don't mind next. Got some good mage XP, so. Ooh. Let's go and do some skeletal wyverns, eh? Skeletal wyvern task is now completed. I don't mind this task, it's pretty chill and I can just AFK on that tile. As you can see highlighted above and what, we just pick up the bones and... Yeah, you get some good money and some good fucking alks and... Yeah, it's just in general a good task. I do like skeletal wyverns. Mm, now let's see if we can get another good task. Um, wouldn't mind the abyssal demons like always, but... Yeah, anything that's... Good with money and XP, but oh, Dagonos, you know what that means. D -d 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 DK, so let's fucking do it. So, just about to begin the DK's task, and I thought I'd just show you a clip of me setting up um, the DK's lair and like the rotations and all that stuff. So, I usually hop down, I'm praying mage because Prime can hit like a motherfucker, and then I'm trying to get Supreme away from Rex so I can go and kill Supreme first, and then Rex, and then Prime. However, if they're grouped like this, um, I try to just aggro the um, Supreme and Prime, and then I can usually Mage, uh, mage and Range prayer them. Uh, but when Rex comes in, and if they're on the same tick, then it's a bit clusterfuck, so I usually just piece the fuck out, like now. And then it was actually just pretty luck that when I went back down, Prime ended up walking very far away, so it was only Rex and Supreme. So, and if, as long as there's two, um, and the other one's not aggroed, and since I don't have to constantly pray, um, mage for this prime, it actually worked out to be not too bad. Ooh, but I was like, ooh, if it comes close though, yeah, I don't know, it's gonna walk away now, but yeah, ended up killing Supreme a lot quicker, because I only had to fucking flick between the, um, the range and the melee attacks from them two, and now I can set up and kill Rex second, and then hopefully prime won't attack me until I attack him so yeah that ended up being a pretty clean but was originally a pretty messy start but yeah i just thought i'd show you this anyway yeah so still at the beginning of the uh task and i've got already two fremenic shields and fremenic and one fremenic blade like bruh and an elite but you know fuck i could have had rings by now man yeah. oh berserker ring number one of the fucking task coming in damn I didn't think I was going to get a ring, because I got an archer's ring last task, so I was expecting to go fucking dry this task. Hmm, we're halfway through, kind of. Oh, what? Another fucking berserker ring? Fuck, man, let's go, man. That's fucking, what, six mil nearly? It's two berserker rings in one task. Oh, so I'm nearly at the end of the task, and I've got a seer's ring now. Thank you, Prime. Three rings in one task, like, shit. 
This is why DKs are my favorite fucking task to do. Hmm, so we've just finished the DK's task, and I must say, three rings in total, and two of them were Berserker rings. Like, look at the Rex tab right now, 6.48 mil. Like, crazy. Hmm, so after a good task, let's see what we get. Ooh, Water Fiends, uh, I don't know, they're alright, but it's just a personal preference. I'm thinking I'm probably gonna skip them, just because uh, I'm kinda slack to do them. They're not that good of a task, in my opinion. So, hmm, redo. Ooh, Necro was easy. Let's do another bursting task. Mage XP for the win. So I've just gone and done the hard and elite clue scrolls. Um, I haven't done the Necro's task yet, but opening the hard first. Not too bad. We got a we got a page and some tellies, but probably just gonna sell most of that stuff and put it as towards money. And then the elite is uh, blessing some part, and it's not that good of an elite. It's alright. It's uh, not too bad. Alright. Yeah, also, I forgot to mention, but anything I get from Clue Scrolls, I'm, I'll show it, but I probably won't count it towards the tab, because it's pretty random, and I need the gold. So, just got 74 agility, one more level to go. So, it's the next day, and we're doing the Necreal Slayer task that we got previously, and just killed a bigger monster, but, yeah, it looks like we didn't get anything but a totem. Totem's alright, that means we can get more Ancient Shards from Skatizo, which means we can keep doing Abyssal Demon with our client charged. So, win. So, another Necreal's Bursting Task down. Um, let's see what we get as the second Slayer Task of the day. Ooh, Greater Demons. Pretty chill task. Let's go do it. Yeah, so just finished the Greater Demons task. Got one Ancient Shard from it, and I pretty much just did them in the Catacombs. So, um, yeah, pretty chill task. So, what we got now? Ooh, Kuras. Let's go and do some Kuras. I'm pretty sure they're, they're not bad. I think they're pretty good at money. Um money making so we shall see Oos, I have just hit 94 hit points so that's getting up there now fuck um, another level down second highest level I think I have apart from 95 range in my skills so yeah pretty cool and it kinda just creeps up on you now it's not as grindy it just kinda happens so huh. a nice little little treat um, so just finishing the task as well now um, it was a fucking solid task a lot of alcohols a lot of herbs and I think I ended up getting I got three Snapdragon Seeds as well, so I ended up making about a mil this task. Alright, let's see what we get. Ooh, Kriara, which is the Armadil boss. Ooh, I've never done Armadil before, so I am extremely keen to see how I go in this. Um, yeah, never done it before. This will be a little bit of a learning curve for me, so bear with me if I get smashed up, but yeah. So, turns out that I probably needed a higher defense. My defense was only 86, and I had pretty budget, um, blessed dehyde, um, armor on with, uh, I guess a crystal shield, so my defense wasn't that best, and I ended up just getting melted. I died once, as you just saw in the clip, but I also killed it twice, which you can see from the tab I will show you on the screen now. So, I didn't end up getting that much, and I got, used a lot of Sarabrews, so, in the end, I just did the two... Uh, and I ended up ca cancelling the rest. And in the future, I might select, still do it, but I'll probably only select three until I get my defense level up, or if I do it with someone else. But yeah, we've got a Blood Veil's task now, and that's a lot more chiller. Halfway through the Blood Veil task, and I am about to get 84 attack. So, yeah, a little, nice little treat on this um, pretty, well, what's usually standard Blood Veil's task. I'm just in the catacombs as well. So, yeah. And just about finished the task now. Got one more to kill. And that was a good task generally, you know. You kind of make your monies back with the blood runes and the insult heads, so not too bad. Let's go for, get another task. So, yeah, I forgot to clip what task I got next, but I've got the um, actual thing unlocked where you can, you know, get assigned a jag task when you get assigned the uh, tzot. Whatever is that you have to kill, you can make it a jag task. So I've got that. Um, and I'm just doing the Jad, I still do the Jad task because they're good XP, and I still don't have the pet. So, yeah, I'm going to keep doing these tasks until I get the pet, and then I'll just be able to skip it pretty easily. So, yeah, this shows the clip now of me killing it. If you guys were interested in a kill of Jad, I'll probably just show it once for this video. And I probably won't show it after, but yeah, I tanked, I tanked a couple, uh, I think one range hit, which wasn't that good when I was trying to multitask at the same time which is never good but yeah no it wasn't too bad and 
in the end, yeah, it was a nice clean JAD task, and I always like JAD tasks, but yeah, and I really just want the pet though, <clears throat> so I always try, you know, if I don't get it, no, I'm always looking for the red text, and then uh, exchange my fire cape in, in, in the hope that I might get the pet, but it's just... Uh, uh, no, nah, never lucky. So after the JAD task, we have just gotten Greater Demons, so I am probably going to go back to the Catacombs to smash out the Greater Demons. Yeah. Noise just finished the Greater Demons task. This is another AFK task. This is the one right after the Blood Veld. nothing too much to report there here. Maybe it's got a couple Ancient Shards, which is good. But about that, yeah, pretty standard, not much. So let's get another task. Mm, so after the 221 task now, after completing the 220 for 75 points, not bad. Let's see what we get. Ooh, Abyss of Demons, guys. Ooh. All right, well, I'm going to leave this till the stream tomorrow. Ooh, this is when shit gets real. This is what we like. Monday after the weekend, and I just got 75 agility, which is what I need. To complete, if we have a look at the Fremenic Elites, it should be crossed out now. 75 agility. Whereabouts is that? Ah, oh, yeah. 75 agility. So we need 80 in the Elites, but 75 you can boost, I'm pretty sure, with Summer's Pie and then complete a lap of the Relic, of course. So we're done with agility for now, which is fucking awesome. But yeah, um, I haven't done any Slayer since the last task, um, we still have Abyssal Demons to do. Um, I've just been doing Agility all day to be honest because uh, if I share with you right now, I've been I've been working on my alt account today. If some of you might remember it, I kind of streamed and I had it in the bottom corner, it was doing some wood cutting for me anyway. But now, so I thought I'd take the day out, um, to me and my mate, we just kind of started this new account and we kind of... Um, and this is his new first time playing RuneScape as well, so I've just started a new account with him, kind of helping him a bit, and so I've been doing a lot of quests and kind of um, being active more on this old account today, so that's why I didn't end up streaming the Slayer, the Abyssal Demons or any more, I haven't done much progress towards the other series, because I've been enjoying making this old account that hopefully will make me a bit of money when I end up going back to the main to do some more grindy levels. So fast forward a little bit after getting that agility level, I have now gone to do to get 75 thieving because I realized that I still needed 75 thieving for one of the hard um, tasks, as you can see here, still from the Keldorim gem store. So I need 75 thieving for that. So I'm just going to get that. My thieving level is 173. So I'm just at Ardoin just doing um just doing that. Just got level 74 as you just saw there. So one more, one, more, one more to go, which won't take me too long, should be able to do it tonight. Um, but yeah, just a little tip as well, I went to, and usually it's attack the RD Knights, and the Runelight plugin seemed to have been fixed, so in the way, so um, it doesn't prioritize pick pickpocketing, because I think RuneScape, you know, under the new terms on service, they changed it a bit. But you can still go into, as you can see down here, you can go to the NPC attack options, and you can just go hidden, which means it won't show up with um, attack it would only be pickpocketing so therefore you can kind of highlight it and you come to three world three seven eight if you want to um, and come to the RD bank and there's usually a lot of guys here do, um, doing the same thing and they've kind of trapped the guard so yeah that's a pretty easy way if you guys haven't heard about it yet but yeah it should be here for one more level and then onto the room crafting grind and then we're done so just wrapping up the video um i guess this is kind of like an in-between video i haven't reached level 87 slay yet on the main i'm still only 86 and i have been progressing this count a bit more so maybe in the future um i might add some progression of this alt account just to see if you, any of you guys are interested in it but i can leave it out but yeah that all de depends on whether you guys want it in but in the meantime um yeah, we're nearly 87 Slayer, halfway to it, and then at the end of um, this Slayer level, I will show you the bank. So, until then, bye!